Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Life at TSL. Today, we're going to go around the office and ask everybody what are their Netflix recommendations? What are their last watched? And what are their top 3 recommendations? Hello, Miss Steph. Hello. Yes. Our beautiful colleague over here who has hair even brighter than Miss Charmaine Sue behind the camera. <laughs> so Steph, do you watch Netflix? Yeah. What's your last watch? Spy Family. Okay, uh, Misha means still behind is uh, nodding in uh, agreement. Yes, anything. So what are your top three recommendations? I really like Strangers from Hell. It's so sinister, so I, I kind of love it. If you want to value add in terms of like your knowledge of like culture, you can watch Pose. Last one. Oh my god. Oh, Cable Girls. If you like a bit like more like adventure, that kind of thing, then like you may so like... it's a movie. Oh, it's a four season series. I think it's set in 1920s and 30s, right? The fashion is like... Love it. So you get like good looking Spanish woman and good looking Spanish man. Yeah. <laughs> Did you hear about Netflix wanting to increase price as well as curb the password sharing and even ad advertisements? Yes. Okay, so right, this one I'm very zitong, okay? <laughs> so the first one I can be very understanding to you, but why do you want to put ads? The reason why I want to watch a streaming show is because I don't want ads. You put ads already, I must well just walk, go to any like streaming website like or something go and watch. If they really implement it, right? I will unsubscribe. Bye. Then I'll go and subscribe to like other things like maybe like or something. Yeah. Wow, this woman, a uh, woman with a Yeah, mission. I'm calling you out, okay, Netflix. So like, please think of me uh, about the ads. Hello, Miss Adria. Hello. Do you watch Netflix? Yes, I do. Okay, what is your last watched series or movie? Actually, right, I just finished 25 21. Were you disappointed by the ending? Or is it an ending no. that everybody deserves? As in, like, I think it's a very real ending. Oh, I don't like the real ending. Yeah, I know we no, don't like, don't but like. then sometimes life is real. No, lah, okay, there are certain shows, right, where the ending is natural. But this show just made me feel very sad. You build up to everything, then you make their relationship like so wonderful and so beautiful <sighs> and then it just ends. But sometimes it's just bittersweet like that. So you recommend? Uh? I, re I recommend. Oh, and I really like Kim Terry. Kim Terry! Oh, yeah, you yeah. won't be seeing this but... <laughs> What are your top three recommendations on Netflix? Unorthodox. It's a limited series. Mm. Okay, that nice. Mm. It's about cults, la, mm. but if you're into that, you can watch it. I like Us and Them. It's one of my favorite films. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, then. I must different all different genres. So the last one is the serious type uh, and like a bit like thriller type, right? Watch the platform. Oh, yeah, the platform. Yeah. That show a bit disturbing. I watched already, I was a bit disturbed for quite a while. Hello, Zayn. Hello. Do you watch Netflix? Yes, I love Netflix. Sorry, I just shouted in your mic. <laughs> Every day I must watch. Oh wow, every yeah, day. Every day I will watch. Wow, somebody got times here. Yeah. God. Somebody. So what is your last watched? My last watch is this anime called Kakegirui. Okay, that one I can watch before. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's a gambling one, right? Yes, it's an anime about like gambling, like school girls, mm. they gamble, then like yeah. But what? What you want to say? What? The storyline perfect, but it's so sexual. It's like the girl, huh? Then, got like wet, wet, got rain off. What are your top three all-time recommendations? Top three all-time. I'm quite a boring person because I tend to watch the same thing over and over and over again. Mm. So, I think Friends is something that we all know. <laughs> I always watch it, I'm just gonna be honest. But, as I say, my top three, right, is Sabrina, the teenage mm. witch. Oh, okay. And then, I also like to watch Stranger Things. Amazing, amazing. And then, the last one, ah. Last one, let me check my Netflix. Uh. Can give two. One is Avatar Legend of Aang, because like it's amazing. I freaking love Avatar okay. Legend of Aang. Okay. The other one is Mrs. Proposal. Uh. Oh, we also must watch this show. Is it cake? Oh yeah! <laughs> It's very good. Yeah, it's very. It's like those mindless shows that you watch when you're eating, then you're very entertained. Yeah. yeah. But sometimes it's like, it's so obvious that it's cake, but I don't know why they cannot see. Yeah. Have you heard of the news about them wanting to add advertisements what? into Netflix? No! Uh. Yeah. The purpose of us paying is so that we can avoid the advertisements. Uh -huh. Then what? What if, right, there's a plan where you have to pay even more money to avoid the advertisements? Will you pay even more? Well, I don't know. La, eh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so are you disappointed by the news? Very. Stop it. Ah. <laughs>
Don't do it, please. I'm begging you. I mean, I love you so much, but please don't. Okay, hi, Fauzi. Hello. Do you watch Netflix? In fact, almost every day. Almost every okay, day. Okay, I feel like it's seasonal. Mm. This is the current season that I have been watching series after series. What are your top three recommendations? Ha! Okay, right now, number one. I would recommend Heartstoppers. It's a queer series. Mm. Very cute, very, um, I would say, very wholesome, like BL kind mm. of uh, show, and I love BLs. And the next thing that I would say is Elite. That show has... The kind of shows that Fauzi watch, I can predict. Yeah, really right? Like, like, scandalous. I know. <laughs> the more scandals, the better. Yeah, you tell me to watch a slow show with nothing happening, no thank you. Yeah. Just okay, I would recommend The Circle. Mm -hmm. Only because, again, I think it's really quite an interesting concept for a reality show. It's mm. a bit like Big Brother mm. plus Survivor, but under the guise of a social media interaction kind mm. of thing. So I think it's very interesting. Mm. Yes. Have you heard that um, Netflix is going to include ads? I've heard. They're going to increase the prices uh -huh, and they're uh -huh. going to curb the password sharing. Wait. Oh no! Oh my goodness! Wait, 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 wait! I'm, I need to think about it. I still will pay. Some, you still will pay because they still create a lot of like reality shows which I still like to watch. Mm. Yeah, but the, the sharing the password thing might might deter me though. Oh, is it? Okay. Like, let's say if I can't share my account with like my brothers, mm. then I might rethink it. Oh. Okay. Yeah. So you're gonna answer. Thank you very much, Fauzi. That's it, uh. Yes. Wow. Okay. Hi, Hi Miss Beautiful Hair. Hi. Miss Multicolored Hair. Hi. Do you watch Netflix? Yes, I do. How many hours a, a week? Oh, oh. How many hours a day? No, actually not every day. Oh, not every day. Yeah, because oh. like, uh, every day play game. Oh, oh So every yes. day play game, no time nah. to watch Netflix. Yeah, pick a poison, right? Correct. Yeah. I cannot do everything at once. Oh, okay. Then my next question is, what is yes. your last watched? Recently, I started this Chinese drama called Falling Into You. Because oh. <laughs> it was on my recommended. And let me tell you, I'm a sucker for anything esports. Uh -huh. I'm a sucker for anything like Chinese drama. Because uh -huh. the Chinese drama like, it is so cringy, right? Uh -huh. But it, Your but, hair was thin that kind yeah, of I love it. Oh. I love it. Another two recommendations you have for our audience? Another two recommendations. Spy Family is an oh. anime. Wow, uh, yeah, you're the second person to say, say this. Spy Family? Yeah. It's so good. What's your third one? Um. Oh! I watch Love is War. Okay, it's another anime. Mm. It's about this girl and guy who are... Enemies again. Kind of the vibe again. Have you heard of that news where um, Netflix say they might include advertisements as oh. well as increase the price subscription? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I did hear about it. Will you yeah. pay? Uh, no way. Because I don't watch Netflix that much. Mm. I used to watch it a lot. But nowadays, I feel like I watch every once in a while. Like some days I don't even watch. Okay, so we have our next interviewee here, a very beloved colleague of mine. Hi Jamie. What do you think about the Netflix shows that you have now? Oh. I guess that's what she thinks about the content now. Thanks Jamie. Hello, we have a very special guest. Uh, I haven't seen him in the office for a long ass time. Mr. Bolin Chen. Hey, hi. Hi, do hi. you watch Netflix? In the past, uh, when I can Netflix and chill. Now, I uh, cannot Netflix and chill anymore. So, I just chill. Lo. That was not an answer I was expecting. Do you have any recommendations on Netflix? Ah, Love, Death and Robot. Love, Robot and Death. Is it? Love, Death and Robots. Love, yeah. Death and Robots, uh -huh. yeah. So recently, they are coming out with season 3. I feel that it has very good story, very good CGI, and uh, it's only 15 minutes. Very fast to watch, oh. and you know, don't have to spend too much time. And also, uh, Mr. Bolin Chen, yes. you a bit boy pie, say. I hope I help you hold the mic for very long. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> have you heard of them saying that they want to increase price, include advertisements, and also curb the password sharing? Have you heard? I I, I do. Technically speaking, I'm quite happy, la, but if they're gonna put in ads, uh, then I pay money for what? Uh? But you will still subscribe. La. Actually, I'm thinking of unsubscribing because recently I don't watch much. La. Oh, why? And the uh, Netflix share keep drop. La. Okay, Menton, do you yeah. watch Netflix? I watch Netflix show. I don't watch uh, Netflix. Ah, uh, 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 What is your last watched on Netflix? I watched mm. The Spy Family. You are the third person to say this today. Why? Is it really that good? It's funny, yeah. Uh. Oh, it's funny, yeah. Uh. It's, it's a funny, it's a funny anime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I like the yeah. Rolling Chang. He's got two comedy specials. Mm. Don't you watch it. I also like Daniel's Loss. His comedy special very dark, man. Oh, okay. Yeah. I just like you, lah. Last guy, the last guy is called uh, Jimmy Carr. Oh, yeah. all, all comedy specials? All comedy specials. You don't watch drama? Rarely, like, very rarely. Like. Oh. I cannot sit down 20, 20 episodes, 30 episodes like, right? Have you heard of them saying that they want to increase price as well as ad advertisements? I heard. 
And then what they do don't do let people share some more. Yes, what do you think about that? I think Leech 1 gonna be Leech 0 soon. <laughs> I don't think you use ready lah, like that. Hello. Hello. Miss Brenda. Hello, Miss. Why you, why you sit so near to me? Because I want to be close to you, Mandy. Ew. Do you watch Netflix? Yes, uh, all the time. I watch it when I am eating. Mm -hmm. Before Sheeting. I sleep, cheating maybe not so much, not that intense. Wow. My liberation yeah. notes. Okay. My liberation notes is my last watch. I'm actually still watching it and I do, I enjoy it very much because right, I I I I I don't know if it's just me, but I've come to an age where those normal like rom coms don't really mm. satisfy mm. me anymore. Oh, okay. And then I like that this show is very real. Uh, okay, my my top one uh, is a recommendation by my friend. It's called Behind Her Eyes. Oh my god, you need to watch it. I feel like it's very underrated. Is this show Behind V? Be, eh, not Behind My Eyes. Behind her eyes. <laughs> so it's very like thriller, a bit like got sci-fi element. Okay. And it's just very mysterious. You have to watch it. Then the ending, uh, the last episode, I like, what the heck? Black mirror, is it? It's a very black mirror, but, oh. but even more twisted. Oh. Ted Bundy. Oh, Ted Bundy. The Ted Bundy taste. Is it the oh I thought it's the hot one where um, no, the not bad, I really like watching true crime documentaries mm. on Netflix, right? Because the producers always somehow get exclusive access to the tapes. This is the only like documentary I watched so far, right? That really sends like chills down my spine. Because the way Ted Bundy talk is so creepy. Mm. Like he looks so normal, right? But he's actually like a bit mental. Ah! The victim skin. You got watch? No. Oh my god. Oh my god. The actors inside are the known actors and their acting is damn good. So it's about murder, lor. and then there's a twist also. You have to watch yourself. If I need to recommend only one, right? Watch behind her eyes. Oh, okay, it's okay. worth it. Okay, okay. Really? Okay. You will be mind blown. Okay. Yes. Um, maybe later tonight I'll go back and watch. Then I'll tell you whether I'm mind blown. Okay. Oh my god, I'm scared because you are a critic. Mm, I am. Okay. Netflix says they're going to raise prices. How and much? Include ads. Let's say you have to pay more in order not to have ads. Will you? Five dollar more. I think I will. What? Oh, you will. Uh. Yeah. Like I will very unwillingly, unwillingly pay. I am too reliant on Netflix. Like I would say, um, my reliance is unhealthy. So you watch during work time also lah? Mm, not really. My yeah. supervisor is there. Yeah, so... <laughs> <laughs> okay, what about yours? You are the queen of critics for movies and dramas. <laughs> wow, a bit stressed eh, when people say that. My recently watched one, I finished it just last night at 4am. That's why my eyes look like that. The Sound of Magic. I'm not sure what to think about this show from episode 1 to 5. It was an enjoyable watch for me. Just that ending, it might not be everybody's cup of tea. Mm. That's all I can say. What's your top 3 recommendations? I'm not going to talk about K-drama since I already did that last time. I think other than the cult favourites like Stranger Things which I love, I like You. It's from the POV of a murderer essentially. But my next one is Alice in Borderland. I'm waiting. Where is the next season? Where is it now? Other than that, I think for a film that I watched quite recently was Man in Love. I cry until my rice become porridge. I cry first time, not enough. I cry again, my tears dry already. I still cry again. And then after that dry away, I cry again. And my mother come into the room and she's like, why are you crying so much? Are you crazy? Yeah, and that's about it. Miss Charmaine Siu, please tell us what are your recommendations. Okay. <laughs> In no order, okay. Alice in Borderland. I also yes. love it. I love. I prefer it more than Squid Game. Stranger Things. Ah yes, which is what I believe a lot of people will say as yes. well. One more. <laughs> oh my god! Bling Empire. <laughs> I think you can be good friends with Fauzi. I love it. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, please remember to like, share, subscribe, ring the notification bell, and watch our other videos over there. Bye. <laughs> nice.